but yeah, wood projects because I can never leave anything alone. <laughs> In our defense, we kind of want to do it before baby arrives because you know, once baby arrives, we are not going to be productive and get anything done. I've been wanting to work on our bedroom for a while now. Not, not that we are right now either. What? Productive. <laughs> We're not productive. We will be in a second. <laughs> so we got paint. We got some wood. There's some cool design we're going to do. That's the biggest change I think we're doing, right? Just yeah. going light. And then I'm painting that sofa we have. Even though I painted it purple, I'm going to paint it now a different color. That will be like the last thing we do once I get the overall feel of the room. So what is the first step, baby? You want to plan out how we're going to... Yeah. Let's go right, see. So let's go, let's go show the idea. Well. I'll get the little ones. You get the big ones. And you just walk upstairs without tripping. Yeah? You just focus on that tripping. Go. Up. Yeah. Upstairs. And this is one. We got it with two um, pink brown. Like a pinkish hue. And I was thinking this one. But it's still kind of dark. Like this one looks good. No? And this is fog. I'm just, I'm afraid we're changing the tone with these, but we're not going lighter. But I don't know. I guess we'll do the big swatch tests. And if I feel like it's too dark, we might be getting like that. I like this one. But for some reason, this in here it gets too so dark. dark. I'm trying to just brighten up the room. So this is the before. This is tough. We'll see. I'm gonna start swatches, yeah? What are you gonna start yeah. doing? Oh, let's frame it first. Okay, so we're playing around with it. Um, they all obviously need to be trimmed. They'll be white. So will the wall behind them. <laughs> um, they're just there for added texture. And then they'll be finished off. Or, what? Well, I don't know what you wanna call it. Topped off <laughs> with, with some extra trim. Um, it's going to be kind of this low, and then I do plan on putting frames halfway between the two colors. Um, I have my, kind of my goal photo. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see if it comes out anything like it. Uh, but if you can see how they have like... I put it in there. Oh, okay. Well, they have like the white. Everything is white, but you that trim in between uh, really helps add some texture to the room and then we are taking stealing that same idea with the frames but we're gonna wait till baby boy is born and then we're gonna take some family photos well one big family photo in the middle and then just them two on the sides <sighs> hopefully um, we'll turn this boring room into something good yeah we're You know you're taking out my time watching the playoffs, the NBA. <laughs> well, <laughs> you're 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 gonna watch the last few minutes like you always do, <laughs> the ones that matter, babe. Um, okay, so I'm gonna paint this white, eggshell white, and then I'm also going to paint the half, the bottom half of the wall white. Uh, while I do this, he's going to go and pick up the paint that we chose because I, I did end up choosing, like, I thought it was going to be dark, but as I did swatches on every single wall, I'm like, no, this is perfect because if we go any lighter, the white won't pop and the idea is to get the white to pop. So I'm going to do this with Lila, although it gives me anxiety. I don't <laughs> even believe. It gives us anxiety when she paints, but we feel bad to say no, so we let her do it and we're just like cringing the whole time. But yeah, so I'm going to start this. You go to the store. Sorry, baby. Hopefully, it's a quick trip. <laughs>
We got progress. We do, actually a lot. I, and I would do more, but because I don't want the paint to be fresh when we go to sleep, I told him we'll stop and then we'll paint again tomorrow. So the white paint on here is already dry. Two coats of it. Um, and then also on the sticks. Now this is kind of the layout. I know that this is gonna throw you off. I just wanted to quickly do it, um, cause these are sitting much higher. And then there's another stick that's gonna go across. And then from there, like, I'll, um, we'll paint the rest, which is this color, by the way. It's a very nice, uh, it cancels out all the blue, so our room had a lot of bluish gray, so it cancels that out, and it's like a very light gray. Well, that one too, I guess. You'll see the difference up there. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. It already looks so good. And the sticks are what made it look longer. Did you notice that? Good. Yep. And that's how it's done. Thank you, Yaya, our videographer. Not my feet. <laughs> she goes onto my feet. <laughs> All right, so this is the nighttime look. Um, probably the last time you're gonna see it because then we're gonna show you guys tomorrow once we do the other paint, which is that paint. I love it. Sorry, my daughter got really excited about the vacuum, and now she's vacuuming everything. <laughs> uh, so. I finished product we will show it to you guys tomorrow because I'm pretty sure we can finish painting them and yeah do you want to tell them now how much it was or once it's all done once it's all done once it's all done all right I love it I love it so I should have not said nothing about the fan yesterday why <laughs> you're like I hate this I know light fixtures are probably the worst that's my most it's not even that it's hard it's just time consuming and it takes a lot of brain energy <laughs> Um, but I'm happy we're switching out the fan. I hate the fans in this house. They are all ancient. I don't, I don't like them. So we got our more modern fan here. Uh, it's double sided. So if you get tired of this color, you can switch to this color, but I don't really think I'll get tired of it. I really like this color. Um, let's do it. It's day two, by the way. I started doing the edges. I'll, I do that first and then he'll come in with the roller. Uh, just because it's easier that way. I don't tape. My tip is get a fine brush, a uh, paintbrush, and just do it like by hand because one, you're wasting less time. Two, it comes out way nicer because a lot of tape sometimes leaks and then it ends up not giving a very flawless finish. Um, this is my little trick to doing it faster and prettier. And a huge difference at night. Right? Huh? Huge difference at night. Oh my gosh. We have blackout curtains, so this room gets black. And it still was like, it had a pinch of light, which I don't mind. I used to sleep with the window curtains open, full, and then I met this one who loved blacking out everything. And then I kind of got adjusted to it, so now that's why we do it. But it looks gorgeous in this room. Oh my goodness. Got for several hours. But every time we get a light fixture up, I feel like such an adult. <laughs> <laughs> like adulting. I got this thing. But this one is harder. Fans plus lights are harder. Like when it's just a light, it's like you connect the wires, you put it up there, whatever. This was a lot of thinking, like a lot of things went into things and then fed through and I'm just like, this is annoying. You, you go from <laughs> from feeling like an idiot to feeling really proud and smart. I know. <laughs> oh, good job. Um, anyways, I do love the color. I, oh, if, I mean, you guys will see the before and after. It just makes such a huge difference. It's like you changed out your parents <laughs> fixture and you got something more modern anyways now that we have lights we can continue painting i was doing a bit more trim in between trim edge in between uh, like helping him so i think i almost finished i did this whole side oh so there i couldn't reach there and then hit that side so we're gonna start painting and see how far along we get i thought we were gonna finish today but yeah. that took longer than i expected but it's worth it do you like the new family i am Oh, I'm sorry. I know. She could barely reach these things on the other one, and they were like double the size. So now she's really not going to reach them. <laughs> oh, that's such a cute detail. They tell you which one is the fan and which one is the light. <laughs> I didn't see that. You saw that no. before? It has like a little light bulb for the light, and then mm. it has a fan for the. Ah! Because I sometimes forget which one I have to do. Anyways, so let's start painting, baby. Yeah. Are you mad? 
I don't know if I'm mad. Is it a blessing in disguise or is it bad? Bad. Does it look yellow in camera? The one in the left is See, the sample. Well, they're, they're both cool slate, but now once we turn on the light, I'm like, there's a difference. There's a clear difference between the two. And we realized they added yellow and red, and that was not in the sample. So, I'm a little bummed because I feel like this looks better. Clear. Like fresher. Because on the camera, everything turns out more yellow because of lighting. So this looks more old beigey gray, or old beigey, kind of like a beige, beige. yellow. You see yellow in it, right? In the camera? Yeah. Right. So I took a photo. I was in the subtle and be like, to my naked eye, it looks fine. But then I took a photo and I'm like, oh my god, it looks so yellow. And I did so much work already. What are we doing? I don't know. I don't want to paint these higher walls and be like, man, we should have just switched when we had a chance. But this looks so fresh. Chris, you know? Yeah. We're changing it, aren't we? Right. <laughs> I wasted a day. No, we are because I, if it looked really yellow when I took a photo and I didn't like that. Psycho. Psycho. With my little. <laughs> Psycho. <laughs> you got No one's gonna see off. that. I see it. And I'm no. blind. If I could see it and I'm blind. No, you're crazy. Yeah, I'm in my underwear. Are you recording my. No. <laughs> You're like, oh, <laughs> in case anyone was wondering, yes, I am still keeping up with my work. <laughs> Can you tell? Uh, That's your everyday. I I know. This is, I only put on pants when I'm going to record. <laughs> if I'm not recording, I ain't got no pants on. Who's got time for that? Uh, but yeah, it's coming along good. He got the uh, second paint, and it's pain because I had to redo everything. But he got me this little handy gadget that just does the edges. I'm just touching up areas. Um, and that worked good, but I'm super happy because I kept looking at it and it looked so beige and ugly and now it looks so crisp and clean, right? Yeah. You probably see it in the camera like, perfect. We got, we got the color down. Lila's helping. Her little helper there, say hi. 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 <laughs> That's cute. That's your first hi for YouTube. That is, right? Because yeah. she didn't, we usually when we say say hi on YouTube, she's like, um, I think not. <laughs> she just walks So away. be proud, everyone. You got <laughs> your first you go. hi. She finally said hi to you guys. <laughs> um, You can see probably there, right? The difference, because that little corner part wasn't done. Yeah. So see how blue it was Yeah. before? Blue and then the top is beige. If you see that oh. top little corner because yeah. I hadn't gotten to it, it's very beigey. But at night it turns almost yellow. Um, so now it looks nice and crisp. So we're almost one coat done and then we got to do a second coat. Ice cream breaks? Yes. Let's do ice cream breaks. All right. We're done. I wanted to finish quicker, had the paint mix up not been an issue we would have finished quicker i put off leg day which is yesterday just paint but it's okay i'll do it today Ta -da! isn't that so nice and that fan though that fan i'm not looking at an ancient fan anymore so that's fun uh, but yeah I, I love the room the only thing that's missing is some artwork well not artwork but i guess framing we're gonna have three big frames big as in like 16 by 20 because that's all that's going to fit in the frame. Um, cute photos. We're going to put that off. Are we putting it off? No. We're going to just do Lila for now? Yeah. So I guess we'll do Lila just because I really want to see some, like the room kind of complete. We're going to do Lila and then once baby's born, we're going to retake photos. And we'll have three frames up there which will really, like, because I feel like it's a little bare. We'll really tie up the room together really nice in rustic frames. Oh. It's gonna be beautiful. There are still changes I'm gonna be making, but they're gonna be small changes and through time. Like, I wanna change the drawers. You can see them on that side too. Um, I feel like they clash right now. So I'm either gonna DIY it myself and, and paint something, but there's also like laminate stickers you can buy um, and change the design. Well, I'm going to think about it because I don't want to jump the gun. We did a lot of jumping the gun when we first bought the house, and now we ended up redoing a lot of stuff. I know I'm going to paint this again. <laughs> I painted it purple. Now I'm going to paint it something else. I want to go white. Hubby says no. 
So I'm gonna think about it. It's gonna take a while, but I'm gonna think about it. So a little changes here and there. I'm, I'm shifting from the purple, so uh, I might end up DIYing this again. I also made that myself <laughs> to match the theme, so I'll probably edit it and make it more, I don't know. We'll see, but ta-da! This is the after. We did the first initial paint job before moving in because we knew we needed to get rid of the crazy colors, which, by the way, when we moved this, I saw the color they had in here. Yeah. Why do they have that color in here? Oh my God, it was such a bad color. <laughs> uh, but we knew that we just wanted out with all their colors. We had browns, deep reds, oranges, greens. We got rid of all of them. And then we knew little by little we would take one room apart and do it kind of how we want to do it, whatever we were going to do. And I think the bedroom is almost done. We got to move to the bathroom. Th That's this a big this red one needed to be done. Huh? The brightness is insane how much it's brighter it is. It's insane how much brighter it is. I always felt like our room was like a dungeon, and I'm like, I don't want to take photos in there. I don't want to do anything in there. But now I kind of just want to chill up here all the time. So that's also not good. <laughs> like, I'm going to go upstairs. Why? I Just to look at the room. <laughs> so, yeah, I really love it. And all we're right. doing the office, too, yeah, right? And the cost. The cost. Oh, my God. So cheap. So, paint. How much was the wood all together? It was 12 like, bucks? Like $12. $12 for these pieces of wood. Just cut them to match your thing. Uh, he had a nail gun already. If you don't, um, you can also hammer it in. Uh, there, there's things you can do. Uh, we patched up where he went in with nails uh, with a little paste. But we've had that since we moved in. <laughs> it's like lasted us forever. It was like this little paste thing. So, 12 Yeah. Then the paint, we bought two gallons of it. And they're about 40 how much each? 39 Oh, 39 Th $40. $34. Yeah. 40 each, so 80 We got the fan, which is probably the most expensive thing. 160 with tax. Yeah. It's like 149 160 with tax. Um, and that's all. That's the only expense. And yet we turned our room. Completely different. Yeah. Kind of like the basement. The basement was only $500. And it's like everyone that went there is like, holy shit, what happened to this basement? So, DIYs, do it yourself, because it'll save a lot of money, and damn, I'm proud of myself. I love it. Yeah, it took us four days, but should have been four three days. days. It should have, no, two days. No? Not three days. Three days? Yeah. Okay, yeah. One day was wasted because of the paint, and it was already late. So mm -hmm. I was like, don't worry about it, we'll go tomorrow. They but that's why I color. ran into leg day, because I always plan everything after leg day. I'm like, after leg day, we start projects, and then by the next leg day, hopefully we're done didn't work out because of that. I dedicated painting instead of leg day, but I'm happy it's done. I love it, what do you guys think? Anyways, we're gonna end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, let me know, because then we'll include you on other renovations. Next is the closet, closet. Next is the office, the office which is gonna be a huge change, like huge. You don't even wanna see what dump it is right now. So let us know if you want to see it because so it takes know. time for us to record them too. Yeah, usually I just like to and jump into things and I don't even think about recording, hence why I was in underwear and he had the camera on. Because <laughs> I'm like, I don't, I, I just want to start, I just want to start. Uh, so it, it takes a little dedication to and start recording. And then to edit too. Yeah, and then to edit it. But if you guys really like it, we're motivated to record the next projects because we even have the bathroom to do. Yeah. So it'll be a small one, but it'll make all the difference. Yeah. We've done like a lot of rooms, even the downstairs bathroom we've done. So, so let us know let in us the know. comments. Anyway, so I got to end it because I got to go do leg day. If you liked it, hashtag love it. Be sure to be subscribed. Hit the little bell right by the subscribe button so you're notified every time we post a video. And until next time, bye guys.